Well, hey, it's David in the stained glass studio, and this is a video we're shooting because we've never done this type of repair before. We don't, right now, we're in high hopes that it'll work. But we really don't know whether or not it will. Here's what's happening. The image that this uh, client has of birds inside this window um, is close to what he wants, but it's not quite. So he brought it to us and asked us if uh, we could center the, the birds in, in this area, move them up, move them over, so that they would fit perfectly. So Jeannie has designed a piece that should fit right in here and so all we have to do is successfully desolder these pieces and we'll be able to drop this panel out and put the new panel in so in order to do that I've got a trash can right here And I've got an iron here. It's almost warm enough. Okay, well I've scraped all of this off, hoping that, you know, that, you know I've got, that I've got uh, a, a weakness so I'd be able to get all of this out in one piece, and that's just not going to happen. So, now I have to do some of the old, the, the uh, removal of glass. And so I'm going to cut on some of these you know these are the uh, outer pieces I really I may not have to take out much maybe if I get Part of it going, maybe I'll be able to start getting the rest of it to, to come out all at once. But uh, this first one,
you see that? Mm -hmm. Oh! <laughs> Okay, now I just have to clean this off. So we've got this part of the window. We've got the, the panel removed, but in the process, this one got cracked. So now we're going to take this piece out and replace it. So the lines have to go this way. And I need to cut three quarters of an inch. Actually, a little bit smaller than three quarter. It'll go right here. Okay, now what we need to do, you can see how this edge is kind of raggedy looking. We need to, we're going to have to scrape it down and then replace the foil. And then run new foil all the way around here, starting here and ending here. Uh, see the difference between the two? How dirty this is and how nice and clean that is? With the stainless steel or the steel. steel wool, it's pretty rough stuff. They they have some that's uh, finer, but this is the stuff that I I bought for a woodworking project. And then I've got this little steel brush here. See how the bristles just kind of wrap right around the, the glass and we're able to just clean that.
All right, here's Jeannie putting on some black backed foil all the way around on the interior of this. When we're doing a regular repair, we try to avoid ripping off the old foil because we don't like to have to put in, you know, uh, extra foil that we don't have to. But on this, we pretty much had to skin the whole thing out. That. Good thing we cleaned it really well. Uh, there was a lot of stickiness to that uh, foil. Now, did you want to turn it so you can go up and down? Yes. She's good at this. That's why you're getting the honor. Does it feel like an honor? <laughs> yeah, sorry I'm not talkative. I'm focusing. <laughs> it's all right. You focus. I'd rather have a good um, application of foil rather than entertainment value here. Alrighty, now this is upside down and this is right side up. Which one do you want to put? Okay. Do we need to take a fid to it? Wouldn't it? Okay, now you get to show them if it fits or not. There we go. All right, little chickadees. Yay. Wow, look at that. That looks good. Okay. Well, let's do some soldering.
So here I am just finishing up the soldering on this window and um, it's just going to be great. And then I'm going to... Um, I filled in a little piece of... Uh, a, there was a little bit, bit of a gap and I filled it in with copper foil. And so... Now we go ahead and fill this up. We're just soldering the window in place. This is the patched repair. And, uh, you know, it's fitting in perfectly. Couldn't ask for a better um, join. It looks just great. And now, here is the final uh, chickadee window sitting in a, a window frame ready to be picked up by the client. It looks great. We're really glad that it's over and done with. But that was an interesting um, project. We hope that you'll join us again. When we have other training videos, please feel free to like us and, and uh, support us on Patreon. We appreciate your time with us. See you next time.